about Uncle Bob? How about so many cross dressers that have made money through this cross dressing of a thing? Hello guys, good afternoon to you, good morning to you, good evening to you, depending on where you're watching me from. So guys, take a look at this video, okay? So, these guys, so, they said, according to the police, they said that they gather, they do marriage between themselves, guys and guys, you understand? So, all of them, oh, they are almost 30 in this place, in a private place, doing marriage. So guys, me and Uncle Ars, I will be the pastor. They will do this marriage for them because most of them that we are seeing in this place said they are not gay okay why the police is insisting that these guys the whole of them are gay see guys you see one thing is that i know they lie and i don't like to be based i'll just send it as it is if you like it no problem if you don't like it no problem okay so what am i trying to say people for me, people are allowed to live the way they want to live so far as they are not hurting anybody. So far as they are not caught doing crime. But in Nigeria, although here in Nigeria, homosexual, homosexual is a crime. For Nigerian, I know that I will say a woman crime. Okay, but even though as of that, these guys they said most of them said that is not what they are doing, that most of them they are what cause dressers. They said they are cause dressers. So, but according to Nigerian law, homo or cross-dressers or whatever is liable to 14 years in prison. But what you call the top, say, if these guys are cross-dressers and they got arrested because they are modeling, because they don't say he's a model, they came for a modeling job, okay? How about Uncle Bob? How about so many cross-dressers that have made money through this cross-dressing of a thing? Even some of them even comes out to say yes. They have boyfriend, they have man friend that is fitting their bills. The police is not arrested, police is not summoned them. There is this small, small ones now, they don't go pack them. You understand? Said they are the new as in, you see this country, the laws in Nigeria are meant for poor people. The law here in Nigeria is meant for what poor people. Once you have money, you can commit any crime that you want to commit. The, the police will repent you. But if you don't get any money, you're gonna enter jail. So you got to use your head. You guys to use your head. Even these guys that came out to do this thing, they should have known. If you don't have someone that is backing you up in this country, before you do some certain things, you reason with your number six. Okay, me and my against, I cannot castigate these guys. I'm not God. I'm not going to uh, uh, maybe do holy patch. You understand what I'm saying? But most times you see all these uh, cross dressers of a stuff that they are doing, or even being this uh, homo of whatever they talk about, just be careful so that. What you they do will not go lead you, just carry your enter panty for nothing. You will spend the rest of your 14 years in prison. Okay? So, guys, if you have a brother, or if you have a brother that you're looking for, kindly look at these videos to know if your brother is there. To know if one nagi, one nagi is there. Okay? So, guys, thank you very much. Share this video. So, other people go to share their family member there among this group. They are models. They say they came for us. Modeling job. The Nigerian guy, the Nigerian police talk say them be gay. Say they won't come arrange gay marriage. Say the other one a wife. Say Siam, he dressed like woman. Say the other one say Siam, he dressed like man. So kindly look if they find your brother in the look well because he might be in a woman clothes. Thank you guys. Thanks for watching this video. Kindly share it. I love you guys. Bye.